All right, Tom, it's early in the year, but what do you think about Shinsu Chu's start? Well, I think when you look at Shinsu Chu, you can't look at him, what he's doing this year. This guy's had a great career. He's been in the, he's been in the league for 10 or 12 years. So what he's doing this year is not unexpected. He's a good player. He watches a lot of pitches. He sees a lot of pitches. He gets on base. He has power to the opposite field. So everything that he's doing this year is, to me, something that you would expect because he's that kind of a player. He's just a good player and always has been. It's not a surprise. What do you think his greatest strength is as a player? I think his best strength as a player is his professionalism and his ability to identify a pitch and not swing at bad pitches. He's always been an on-base percentage player. That's why he's been attractive to other teams. That's why the Rangers signed him. They wanted somebody to hit at the top of the lineup who got on base a lot. The advantage that Chu has is in addition to being that kind of a guy, he also has power. So he's not just a guy who gets on base. He can drive in runs, hit home runs, hit doubles. It, you kind of get the best of both worlds when you get him as a leadoff hitter. And that's what the Rangers wanted when they gave him that big contract. And if you look at what Chu's done since he signed that big contract, each year he's done everything the Rangers would want. If you could have said to the Rangers right now, this is what Chu would have done when you gave him the contract, they would look at each year and go, good, that's exactly what we hoped for. Okay, he's easily the most accomplished player from Korea. What do you think continues to drive him? I think with any, with any great player, any ball player, whether it was someone like Nolan Ryan who played till he was 45, whether it was um, any player who's played well into their 30s, it's, it's pride, it's competitiveness, it's the love of the game, it's being able to stay in shape. So if you, if you have something that you love, and Chu loves playing baseball, he takes great care of himself, he's strong physically, he's strong mentally, and he has a lot of pride. Now at this stage of his career, I think he takes great pride in being someone that the young players can look up to and come to him and ask questions. We see our players talk to him all the time about identifying pitches, getting on base, what to do to be a professional. Now we're starting to see players on other teams come up and ask him questions. So I think the pride, the competitiveness, and the love of the game is what motivates him to stay competitive now. Okay, last thing for you, he was an all-star last year for the first time in his career, which is kind of surprising, really. Uh, can he be an all-star again this year? Yeah, I think right now he's definitely an all-star this year because he's having a better year this year than he did last year. Um, I look at Chu as a guy, when the season starts, he's a definite candidate to be an all-star. I'm surprised that last year was the first time he made an all-star team. And unless he gets hurt, I don't see any reason why he won't be an all-star again this year. Como <laughs>